give you an idea of some changes that I've seen in the last 16 years I've been here. This bridge we're going across has been raised three times. The height of the bridge would have been what the height of the river is now. The group that I picked up from Rainforest, the old hostel used to be down here to the right beside those motel units, and they were higher than the river when I arrived here. Good morning people of the internet. It is going to be a really really good day today because the sun is shining, it's blue skies and I'm walking to Franz Josef. For those of you who don't know, Franz Josef is like a massive massive mountain with snowy tops and looks really really cool. So um, yeah, that's exciting. I've got a few friends with me. Say hello. 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 And um, yeah, we're going to walk to the closest point to then take photos and stuff because obviously we're not actually hikers so we can't walk up the entire mountain um, but uh, we're gonna get really really close and it's probably the best day for it I think with the sun and the blue sky so uh, yeah I'll let you know how we get on So we're just at the foot of the mountain and all these springs, so all this water coming down now, this is absolutely fresh and clear. So we can fill our water bottles up here and drink this water. Like there's no um, bad stuff in it. It's all, it's all clear, fresh from the mountain. And that looks like a good place to fill it up. So uh, let's do that. So as you can hear, the helicopters overhead, that is the most expensive way and the best way to get to the mountain. Um, it's the only really safe route to get to the top. So there's like dozens of helicopter trips per day for people to go. Um, but it was like $400 and that's kind of way out of my budget. So I'm not doing that, instead, I'm walking to the bottom to look. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty amazing right now though. I'm just in awe. New Zealand, you're just so beautiful. Can I live here, please? Just wow. So we made it. This is as far as we can go. This little man here is telling us to stop. And uh, yeah, this is as close as I'm going to get. Still pretty stunning though. Say goodbye to the glacier. Okay, so we got back, picked up our bags, and now we've got to try and hitch a lift, and I've got my sign. <laughs> Let's do this. Yep, 
Yo, so we hitched a lift from a very uh, kind man called Philip. So um, a big thank you to you, Philip, if you end up watching this. He dropped us at Lake Matatusu or something. I can't pronounce it. I don't know where the girls have gone. They're looking at the map. Um, so yeah, we're just going to walk around the lake because apparently it's stunning. The day is still beautiful. It's sunny, um, blue skies. Clouds have now come over the mountain. If you just look at this, um, basically all that cloud there is covering the the mountains. Um, you can brief, you can slightly see it over there a little bit. Um, but yeah, it's it's a good day. It's always going to be a good day when the weather's like this. So yeah. Running low on steam and I'm wishing you were here but I can't believe that we're so far from home I'm trying to find my way but I just can't shake you from my mind You're the one I'm always hoping for get a beer and chill out really because it's been a long drive it took us like three hours to get here I'm tired um, but yeah we're staying at the base hostel um, which is a very popular hostel so uh, hopefully meet some people and uh, yeah I'll speak to you tomorrow if you like this video hit subscribe join the journey all that jazz and I'll speak to you real real soon bye <laughs>